We're here in the interactive plant environment at Emerson's facility in Minneapolis, Minnesota. This video will cover the Rosemount 802 multi-channel discrete input-output transmitter and how to commission it to an Emerson wireless gateway. Rosemount 802 is hazardous rated, environmentally protected, and features up to eight discrete channels, which are all configurable to be either input or output. Before you could begin using the Rosemount 802 transmitter, you first need to get it connected to a wireless heart gateway. Equipment needed to commission the Rosemount 802 transmitter are the Emerson Wireless 1410S2 or 1410S1 gateway, paired with the 781S smart antenna. Black Emerson 701P smart power module or 10 to 30 volt DC power supply. Heart interface modem. Computer with AMS device configurator installed and a Phillips screwdriver. To get access to the transmitter, first you need to back out the two cover screws using a Phillips screwdriver. Unique to the 802, it can be powered by either the black Emerson Smart Power module or by a 10 to 30 volts external power. To power the transmitter, remove the plastic orange protective plug covering the battery terminal and discard. Simply take the black power module and plug it in. Alternatively, slide the guide over to expose the external power terminals. Feed the cable through the cable gland to power the Rosemount 802. Once you get the terminals in place, you secure them using the Phillips screwdriver. With the 802 powered, now we can input the network key and join key to get the transmitter connected to the gateway. Using the heart interface modem, Connect the clips to the communication terminal. In this example, we are using Emerson's AMS device configurator software to interface with the Rosemount 802. Open AMS device configurator on your computer, select wired configuration, and the device should automatically appear. Only Emerson devices are supported with this software. On the AMS device configurator overview screen, click on network settings on the bottom right hand corner. Input the network ID and join key obtained from the gateway you want to connect the transmitter to. Remove the heart interface tool from the transmitter. To verify the Rosemount 802 join the network, go to the gateway user interface to verify device connection. As you can see here, the 802 transmitter has connected to the Emerson gateway successfully. You have now completed the commissioning process. For a complete set of installation instructions, please refer to the Rosemount 802 product data sheet on our website.